Hi there, kumusta kayo? Welcome to Sir Matigo. Ngayon ay gusto kong ipakita sa inyo kung paano isolve ang ganitong equation. Ang tawag nito ay absolute value equation. Pero bago tayo magpatuloy, alamin muna natin ang ibig sabihin ng absolute value of a number. The absolute value of a number is the distance between that number and zero on the number line. Halimbawa, what is the absolute value of 6? Kung titingnan natin sa number line, the distance from 0 to 6 is 6. So, the absolute value of 6 is equal to 6. How about the absolute value of negative 6? Tingnan natin sa number line. The distance from 0 to negative 6 is 6. So, the absolute value of negative 6 is 6. Masasabi natin na the absolute value of a number is always positive. Balikan natin ang ating absolute value equation. The absolute value of 2x minus 6 subtracted by 4 is equal to 20. Solution. I-transpose muna natin ang negative 4 sa kanan. So, magiging the absolute value of 2x minus 6 is equal to 24. Gumamit tayo dito ng addition property of equality. Kailangan ang matira sa kaliwa ay ang expression na may absolute value bars. Ngayon, paano natin maintindihan ang equation na ito? Ganito. The expression inside the two bars is either 24 or negative 24. Tingnan nyo. The absolute value of 24 is equal to 24. And the absolute value of negative 24 is equal to 24. Kaya masasabi natin na 2x minus 6 is equal to 24. And 2x minus 6 is equal to negative 24. Dalawa ang ating equations, dalawa rin ang ating values ng x. Now, let's solve for the values of x. Let's start from 2x minus 6 is equal to 24. Let's transpose negative 6 to the right and we have 2x is equal to 24 plus 6. Then, 2x is equal to 30. Now, let's divide the whole equation by 2. Then, we have x is equal to 15. Let us solve 2x minus 6 is equal to negative 24. Transpose negative 6 to the right, we have 2x is equal to negative 24 plus 6. Simplifying, we have 2x is equal to negative 18. Divide the whole equation by 2, we have x is equal to negative 9. These are the two values of x that will satisfy our absolute value equation. Let's check if these values of x are correct by substituting the values of x to our absolute value equation. Let's start substituting x equals 15 to our absolute value equation. Obserbahan nyo po kung paano i-manipulate ang mga numbers. Ayan po, nakita natin sa last statement that 20 is equal to 20. Ibig sabihin, the value of x which is 15 is correct. Isa pang value ng x natin ay negative 9. I-substitute natin ito doon sa x ng ating absolute value equation. Ilalagay ko na rin po dito kung paano i-substitute yung value ng x at paano i-manipulate yung numbers hanggang sa huli. Ayan, nakita nyo po, 20 is equal to 20. Ibig sabihin, tama po ang value ng x natin which is negative 9. So, dalawa po ang tama na value ng x natin which is 15 at saka negative 9. Yun po ang magsasatisfy sa ating absolute value equation. Or, yun lang ang ating solution. Paano naman kung ganito ang ating absolute value equation? Paano naman ito isolve? Yan ang susunod kong video. Kaya, guys, please like, subscribe at huwag nyo na pong kalimutang Pindutin ang notification bell para manotify kayo sa susunod kong video. Maraming salamat. Bye now.